Time now for your weekly island report and it kind of sounds like a setup for a joke. But what do you do when your floating cabin gets stuck in the sand and has to be removed? But it's not a joke for owners of cabins along the Laguna Madre who face fines if their cabins are not removed. Island Moon newspaper publisher Dale Rankin takes a look in this week's Island Report. Probably many of you have been to some of the floating cabins along the backside of Padre Island, south of Bird Island. But over the years, high tides and hurricanes left some of those cabins aground, and something had to be done. About, About a everything. dozen of the cabins ended up like this one, Cabin. well away from the water, with owners facing fines of $1,000 per day if they are not removed. So the cabin owners called Todd Horn, who owns Texas Repo and Consignment, and he came up with a plan make giant rollers out of cable reels and cover them with plywood. Use them to roll the cabins out. The power comes from a 450 horsepower winch on a work barge that's anchored with eight foot long augers twisted into the sand. There were some problems along the way when a boat ran aground and the giant wheels got stuck in the mud. And there were some broken axles and heat strokes in the August sun. It kind of looks like something right out of the Flintstones, but it works and the job is almost done. Still gotta go. Besides, it all just looks kind of cool, right? Necessity is indeed the mother of invention. For 3 News and the Island Moon newspaper, I'm Dale Rankin, and we'll see you on the island. Dale, thank you.